Alright, so this is the campaign that I haven't forgotten. I believe his name is Blasco Zero? 666 or something like that? I haven't forgotten this one. So here I go, I'm gonna play the two maps of this campaign that I need to um, catch up. So right now I have no idea what's going on. So this is his second campaign. I played the first campaign. I thought, you know, it had its moments. But I felt like a lot of the early levels were just very amateurish and kind of like not really as not really um hold it doesn't hold up as well as I feel like it should have compared to like some of the other campaigns I played. But I remember liking like a lot of the custom deal stuff. They were pretty interesting. It's time we meet. So let's see how his second campaign does here. Alright, so we got classic graphics. I'm Dr. Samuel Hayden, I'm the head of this facility. I think we can work together and resolve this problem in a way that benefits us both. The facility will not allow you access to the turbine room unless the demonic threat level is brought down inside the foundry. Plasma the gun. security systems cannot be overridden. Ooh. Take whatever supplies you need. Kind of a weird a way to use this texture for like, you know, walls. You know, this is like supposed to be an elevator. Uh, I don't know. Not really my kind of key, I mean cup of texture that I would use. Alright, let's go. This is not the OP, yeah, this is not the OP open. Oh, there's hit markers. Boom. Oh my god, my neck is killing me, dude. I think I'm gonna be able to play like only two more maps here. I think because Unrelenting Evil took so much longer than I thought. So I'm gonna have to like skip some of the maps that I wanna do. Whoa! But then again, what is it? I plan on doing like a live com with Modman. Hopefully, nothing happens, you know? So stay tuned for like a co op episode later on. Oh, my favorite gun there. I'm a Quake player, so yeah. Ah, my... oh, why didn't I detonate that? I'm a Quake player, so I love my rockets. Alright, so we're getting a lot of weapons here. Pretty cool. I don't know how I feel about that for like a campaign. You know, I feel like... When you make a campaign, you should try to give me like only the weaker weapons, and as I play through it, I get stronger weapons. But who knows? Maybe this campaign's trying to raise up the standards a bit, trying to let me have all the good stuff, fight all the bad guys in quick succession. Who knows? We'll we'll see. So far, I kind of wish this area is a bit more decorative. I feel like there's not really much decoration here. Where's that imp I hear? These are definitely custom enemy spawns. I don't- I remember his campaign was one life only. So I assume this is probably the same thing too. So I gotta keep that in mind. Try my absolute hardest here. Woo! Piece of shite. Oh wow. Oh my grenade fell failed me. I mean yeah, failed me dude.
Oh, let's go, baby. Oh my goodness, where is it? Oh, I don't have a chainsaw. Alright, this is getting a bit sweaty. Oh, night just glitched up again. Where's the chainsaw? I think I'm missing it. Wow, you did a lot of ammo with the shotgun. I don't know if these items respawn. I don't think they do. I can find the freaking chainsaw. Oh! Nice try, Baron. I need to find that chainsaw. I think I'm missing it. It has to be around here somewhere, man. like a secret it has to be like a secret chainsaw or something I think it's probably like a very sneaky secret. Wait, can it be? This looks really funky here. I don't know. I'm gonna skip it. I'll just try to be more careful with my ammo. Interesting placement there. Alright, where the hell do I go now? Extra rocket launcher if I need it.
mega health here. Striking my goodies here. Oh, how did that miss? So far, you know, I'm getting kind of bored of this campaign, which is definitely not a good first impression. It just feels very like dated. You know, it's like it has like very little um, decoration, and it's pretty much just like a bunch of preset areas you go. Just slay as much demons before you know you slay enough and just move on to the next area. You know, with some better decoration or like some sort of better pacing, this could totally make the campaign more interesting. Who knows? I'll give the second level a shot. So far, it feels very amateurish for my taste. What the hell is that? That was kind of cheap. These guys have extra health. Oh no, it's, they're the same. I assume that I can't go through the fire. I think it's going to kill me instantaneously. That's it? Oh wow. Alright, I'll say this map, it was passable, but it just feels very, very mediocre. There's kind of like nothing special about it, man. Like, it feels very amateurishly designed. Like I said, just going to a bunch of preset arenas, fight, a couple of like custom enemy wave spawns, then do the same thing until you reach the end. But I did enjoy it, so I will give it like a rating. You know, I'll give it a thumbs up. But, yeah, you know, this level, I don't know, man, didn't give me the best first impression, but let's see how the second level is here. Oh, shoot, I forgot. If you do want to, like, play, here's the map ID, if you want to give this map a shot, 1.1 Resurrection. I don't really know what the campaign's, the campaign's name, but, you know, if you just kind of want to, like, Slay some demons until, you know, it's done. There it is. But yeah, I just wish there's better pacing to it. Um, um, what else? I want a better pacing to this map. For example, like I said, all I'm doing is I'm just going to a bunch of preset areas that isn't really that heavily decorative, and I'm just finding a bunch of custom enemy spawns, and that's it. Then I just keep on doing it until it's over. Um, I really don't know how I feel about, like, for a first map, it's already giving me all, like, the strong weapons and stuff. It really doesn't give you, like, a good, um, good, like I said, it doesn't give you, like, a good pace to the campaign. Like, what happens if Doom 2016 gave me all the weapons that I wanted, and it was like that from start to finish? I think that's definitely going to be a problem for sure, you know, because it just doesn't feel right. And, um, yeah, I just wish there's, like, some more decoration to it, some better pacing. And, like I said, it just feels amateurishly made. But who knows? Let's see how the second map is going to be. 1.2 Metro.